Once upon a time, I worked for a little fishing company and I was the junior baiter. After six months, they promoted me to master. Oh, get your mind out of the gutter. <laughs> Talk on outside. Hope you're doing well today. All right, so it's been a minute since I've put any content out on the channel, and I'll tell you, I've got a whole new appreciation for people that put out this type of content on a regular basis. I have been getting a lot of stuff done. Um, I just sometimes want to get stuff done and not mess around with the camera, but as you can see here this morning, I'll put up a time lapse of the work we did. My son and I got out here this morning and we cleared off an area here on the dam. And we got a nice little place where we can throw some hooks in the water here. So um, got a couple of good sized trees out of the way. I uh, added a winch to the old gator and that come in pretty handy today, pulling some of the bigger trees. Cause uh, as you can see kind of off to the sides of there, I'm not gonna have any choice but to kind of fall some of these into the water and then drag them out to trim them up and get them out of the way. But uh, walk over here a little bit and kind of show you one of the things I'm up against probably this fall that's gonna have to be fixed is uh, you can see at some point in this pond's life, um, there was kind of a, a washout here. It was about a know, three foot drop down um, where the dam was overtopped at some point and eroded away. So I've got to get this leveled back out. Um, so the person that does this work is going to also put in a new siphon drain system for me. And once that work is completed, probably about uh, where that tree is is where the new water level is going to be. Um, back to where it originally was when the pond was first built back in the late 70s, early 80s. So, like I say, got some work to do. And you see, you can go, once that'll be completed, I can go on the other side of the pond, which I can come in that way from the north side of the property. And uh, I'll be able to take the old gator on an excursion and do a complete loop around the property. So, like I say, post a little update here, showing some of the work that we've got done. And uh, I'm gonna do a little bit more work today and try to clear out another path over on the far side of the property there. There's a power transformer. Kind of hope that uh, Georgia Power was gonna market better for me, but they didn't. So I'm gonna have to clear a path into it. So that means yours truly gets to run the brush cutter again and make all kinds of dust, but we're gonna get it done. All right, so this time around, we'll do a little bit of a voiceover on the time-lapse footage here. I have my son helping me here today. You can kind of see where we started uh, in the area that we were working that I just was kind of talking in front of in the intro there. And uh, like I said, added the winch to the gator, knew when I was going to have situations like this. That tree that we just kind of cut down there, it was already started to be cut down by whoever owned the property before me. Um, and at some point, it just kind of fell over part way. So cut out the rest of the way and drug it up there and started chopping it up and getting it out of the way. So, and you'll see me uh, kind of at some point here, we'll start tag teaming out. I've set a fan up on the, the gator over there because it was uh, like 90 something degrees and almost 100 degree heat index. But uh, I've got my little Jackery power station and a box fan there, kind of had to fiddle with it because the wires were kind of frayed a little bit. Had to fix that just when I got home and had lunch and Got that going again, but uh, son helping me out, we kind of started tag teaming. He'd cut a little bit and I'd stand in front of the fan and then we'd swap out, I'd cut a little bit, he'd stand in front of the fan. So hydration and cooling is the key in these Georgia summers, y'all. So, but uh, at the end of the day, made some great progress. Got a nice little area to just kind of set up a couple chairs and just sit and enjoy nature and uh, just, you know, be. So I did get some more work done on the north side of the property, like I said, and uh, didn't take any video for that, but just kind of called it a day and uh, we'll post something up soon. Until next time, go outside.